The goal of our method is to isolate nuclei from fresh frozen tumors, and the same nuclei preparation can be used for transcriptional and epigenetic studies. Therefore, we can ask several key questions such as how do tumors evolve during progression and how do therapies affect tumor composition. The biggest advantage of this method is that it is simple, reduces processing time and most importantly yields high quality nuclei. The absence of a sorting step reduces stress on the nuclei. And the other advantage is, it, is its ability to be used on archival frozen tumors. Demonstrating the procedure will be Ashwin Narayanan, a postdoctoral fellow from my laboratory. Begin by transferring 10 to 60 milligrams of fresh frozen tissue sample to a pre-chilled petri dish. Mince or chop the fresh frozen tissue with a razor blade into small pieces on ice. Add 500 microliters of chilled nuclei lysis buffer onto the tissue in the petri dish. Then transfer the mixture to a douncer. Dounce the tissue pieces with the loose pestle for about 20 strokes until friction is reduced. Then dounce it with the tight pestle for 20 strokes to achieve complete tissue homogenization. Transfer the homogenate into a pre-chilled 2 milliliter tube and add 1 milliliter of chilled lysis buffer into the douncer. Rinse it and add it to the tube. Mix it gently and incubate it on ice for 5 minutes, mixing with a wide bore pipette tip 1 to 2 times during the incubation. Filter the entire homogenate using a...